There are fighter jets incoming. Take cover. Just kidding. But thankfully, radar helps us see what we can't. Buckle up. Let's discover radar today. Radar, which stands for Radio Detection and Ranging, is a detection system that uses radio waves to detect and locate objects such as aircraft, ships, and other vehicles. Radar works by emitting a radio frequency signal which travels through the air at the speed of light. When the signal encounters an object, some of it is reflected back towards the radar receiver. The receiver then detects the reflected signal and measures the time it took for the signal to travel to the object and back. From this time delay, the radar system can determine the distance to the object. In addition to distance, radar can also determine the direction of an object by using directional antennas or by comparing the signal strength received by multiple antennas. This information can be used to determine the bearing or angle at which the object is located relative to the radar. Radar can also measure the speed of an object by detecting changes in the frequency of the reflected signal caused by the Doppler effect. As an object moves towards or away from the radar, the frequency of the reflected signal is shifted, and this shift can be used to calculate the object's speed. Modern radar systems can use complex signal processing algorithms and multiple antennas to provide even more detailed information about objects, such as their size, shape, and composition. The first practical radar system was developed by the British during World War II and was used to detect incoming enemy aircraft. The technology quickly advanced during the war, with new radar systems being developed for a variety of military applications such as navigation, target tracking, and early warning. Radar is used by the military to detect and track enemy planes, ships, and missiles. This allows them to respond quickly to threats and protect their troops and equipment. There are many types of radars in the world, but one that stands out is the Duga radar system. The Duga radar system, also known as the Russian Woodpecker, was a Soviet over-the-horizon radar system that was operational from 1976 to 1989. It was designed to detect ballistic missile launches from the United States by bouncing radio waves off the ionosphere a layer of the Earth's atmosphere. As you can see, it is massive. Besides military purposes, here are many other ways that radars are used. Air traffic control. Radar is used by air traffic controllers to monitor the movement of planes in the sky. This helps to prevent collisions and keep planes flying safely. Weather forecasting. Radar is used to track weather patterns and predict storms. This information is used to issue warnings and help people prepare for severe weather. Navigation. Radar is used by ships and planes to navigate in foggy or dark conditions. The radar signal bounces off of objects in the environment and helps the operator to locate their position. Speed detection. Radar is used by police to detect the speed of cars on the road. The radar signal bounces off of the car and back to the radar unit allowing the police to determine how fast the car is going. My experience with radar specifically relates to usage in the military. I'm a United States Air Force veteran, and I have a long history of experience working with radar. Over a decade ago, I was a crew member of the E3 Sentry, also known as the AWACS. The radar on the AWACS, the black and white UFO looking object on top, is special because it can scan a really wide area hundreds of miles away very quickly. It can also track lots of different objects at the same time, like hundreds of planes, ships, and even vehicles. This makes it really useful for military operations where there might be a lot of activity going on. All of the information that the AWACS radar collects is sent to a control center on the ground, where military personnel can analyze it and make decisions about what to do next. They can use the radar information to coordinate with other military units and respond to threats quickly and efficiently. It was really amazing to see radar technology used so often firsthand during my military career. In conclusion, radar is a versatile technology that has many different applications in our world today. It allows us to detect and track objects that would otherwise be invisible, providing us with valuable information for safety, navigation, and so much more. <laughs>